Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of r, &R. Today we are doing resin pour, which I'm not that familiar with, but... It's epoxy. This is the one I'll be doing. Resin pour. I have the sparkling glitter one. Mine comes with hexagons, gloves, sticks, and the stuff we'll be sparkling mixing. I love sparkling glitter. What is that? Oh, that's the glitter. Yeah. The cup. Go ahead, baby, your turn. And I have the river looking one. Resin pool. See? It is. It is. Comes with mosaic tiles. Yeah. Alright, guys, let's get right to it. We don't want to bore you guys with the boxes. So, we'll see y'all. Yeah. Alright, so let's open it up. Oh, that's small. That was going to be big. Oh. Yeah, that's tiny. That looks nothing compared to this. Yeah, it don't look like that. <laughs> I don't understand how yours works. The epoxy goes in here and it hardens. And you feel like we should do it. It's complicated. Maybe. We're going to figure it out. <sighs> this seemed like a lot of work. Who I did with this was driving. Okay, so we're going to work on <laughs> one at a time. One at a time because it's complicated. It seems complicated. Just because. Just so we don't mess both of them up. Uh, which, color you, on? which color you want to do first? It don't matter. The blue one. The blue one? But we have to mix the resin yeah, we, in the hardener first. We have to mix the resin first and then we go mix mix the color in. Yeah. It says start things off by prepping your resin and hardener for a ratio of one to two of hardener and resin into your mixing container, which is in this case our Chick-fil-A cup we had for breakfast. Alright, so go ahead, pour it. So pour hardener. hardener, that's gonna be our one. So do 15 of the hardener. Yes. What is that? 15 mLs. Now do 30 mLs. Oh, this thing is cheap. Yeah, it's cheap. This thing is rip off. You don't even look like the picture. Oh. Oh, okay. Mix it. Yeah. Okay, mix slow. Yeah. You have to mix thoroughly. That's not mixing. That's not mixed thoroughly. Yes, it is. Mm -hmm. I don't want to spend too much mixing it. I mean, spend too much time mixing it's it. It's a mix thoroughly, baby. Alright, do you want to add the dye now? Yeah. Yeah, move. Blue. Whole thing? Yeah, put the whole thing in there. Does it say how much we cut to put in? No. I put the whole thing in there. You put the whole thing in there? Yeah. All right. While you do that, I'm gonna do this one. No, no, no. We're supposed to do. We're supposed to do the colors together. I said I gotta add some glitter in here. I'm gonna add my glitter. Don't add too much. Yeah. You can never have too much glitter. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna add half in here, half in that one. No, because at the end you can also add some on top. Okay. 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 Yeah. Oh, oh wait, all the glitter. Oh, I should have showed him me doing it. We only have 30 minutes to work with the resin before it begins to harden. You got you getting it? Yeah. This is not gonna look bad. <laughs> <laughs> it did look it looked bad the whole time. Yeah. Okay, you ready for glitter? Go ahead. Wow, pretty! Oh, pretty! Pretty! You see it? Now show the camera. Show the camera. Oh, that don't look good. Yeah, exactly. Mix it. That looks better right there, like that. Yeah. See how it shimmers right there? Glitter, glitter, glitter! Put that some more glitter. More glitter. More glitter. Come on, let's get the board. Alright, I'm about to board. You ready? Go ahead. I'm scared. 
Yeah! Baby. Come on. I made a mess, baby. Leave it alone, leave it alone, leave it alone. What you doing? How you gonna pour my stuff first? Well, the red looks pretty. Let me go, let me go. Oh, it said don't overfill it. That's over? No, go ahead, fill the corners. Um, I thought we was gonna mix one. Yeah, we're gonna mix one right you, here. You didn't have a... There's no pattern to this. We needed a pattern. Oh, baby, I'm up. Don't touch it. It's just gonna smear it. Just let it harden it and you can just peel it up. Cause you don't got a steady hand. I do have a steady hand. Man, I made one look, mistake. Uh, look, 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 Mr. Steady. And then I said to do this. This sucks. <laughs> it's not how I imagined it to be. No, baby, that make it worse when you do that. You don't need to do that. See how it's starting to overflow it? That's the design. I did that on purpose. Yeah, you're going to spray the glitter on top of everything? Yeah. This just looks disgusting. I do. Well, we're still going to post it. Because we need to be consistent. I think it looks beautiful. Now tell me, does that look like that? It's not dry yet. You can't even really tell the colors on there. <laughs> So Alright, we gotta mix it again. We're gonna try mine, but. And this time, our extra cup is a water bottle that we cut in half. It's okay. We're gonna mix it the same way we mixed the last one. You wanna place these before we pour it? Okay. I'll put some in. Rob, Robbie wants me to pour some of these in for some reason. And we're supposed to glue this together, but we don't have no glue. And I told Robbie, let's just use some glue stick or whatever. He said no. He said he don't care about it that much. So I don't know how this one turned out. He don't want to listen to me. We do need to glue it, or it's just gonna seep out. It's just gonna seep out. Maybe that's the point. Yeah. Please tell me how that's gonna work. It's gonna work. I'm just gonna glue it myself. You know everything, baby. When it comes to stuff when like this. When it comes this. to stuff like this, I know what I'm saying. No, I'm putting this in there. So, so don't trip off me, boy. Don't trip off me, boy. Cause I'm, I'm already mixing them. Okay, baby, good job. You want to cook it now or later? No, I mix it. You just add the colors. I'm done. I'm done too. You gotta make sure it's mixed thoroughly. Okay, it's mixed thoroughly. I'm not doing. I think my glue is working. You're welcome. And guys, don't put this down your sink. Okay, just throw it away. That's all the mosaic tiles you're gonna use. For now. I shouldn't have smeared them. I should have just let them dry and then peeled them off, like Robbie said. Yeah, you were right, whatever. But I want to paint this to hide all these mistakes, but we don't have enough paint. So this is how it turned out. And on the back, as you can see, all of the resin or hardener and dye seeped through. So it's all over everywhere. It dried hard and it is on here. So it just looks, it just looks like that. That's the back. And some of the some of it had came off to the side I just cut it off a little so 
this is how it turned out. This is probably the better looking one. Now this one, I mean, it was kind of ugly when we did it. It looks okay. Um, we thought the hexagon. It is hard too. They're both hard. It has green and red throughout. Again, I'd want to paint this one too to cover up some of those marks and just to make it a little more vibrant and better. Uh, nothing on the back of this one, nothing see through. It's fine. But yeah, I don't know what we're gonna do with these. Don't put the trash. We're probably just gonna keep them around, find some paint, and end up painting this. And I want to do this again on a bigger scale. Maybe, but it does work. This stuff is hard. Uh, I think we just need better. What are these canvases or? Yeah, basically. Yeah. So. Let us know what you guys thought. Let us know which one is your favorite. Probably the blue one. All right, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And don't forget to comment down below what you guys think about this video. Thanks for watching.